Welcome to the HHJ Railroad Hickory Hollow Junction. It's been a while, but I just had an obsession last night. All went pretty decent. First obsession. And I have a few people asking for videos, so keep people happy, keep family happy. So you can see I have a, a friend's collection of model railroader on the bottom there. I have the first issue of 1934 in current. So I'm going to start you off at the beginning of the railroad and show you. Alright, so you start off here in staging. It's a 10 track staging yard. I don't have it lit yet. And one part of the yard is staging is Milwaukee. The other half is Oakland, Maine. So you have the Y there. You come around behind the brewery, which is kind of a mock-up. Then you can take, if you're a, a through freight, you would take the lead in into the yard here. The raised right white road bed is the main line. So here we're entering Birchdale Yard. The yard is broken in two by the main line in the middle. To the left is the south yard and to the right is the northern yard. It takes two yard masters to run it. Then here on the right is a car shop by the throttle. And then you cross the bridge and the left is a branch line. The center is the main line and to the right is the switching lead for the yard. Come around here, now we're entering Dixie. If you're on the branch line. Dixie's going to get reconfigured a little, but it is. It is what it is. The main's up high now and down low is the branch line. So if you're on the branch, now you're entering Santa Ann, which is a port with a car float. I have two of the Walther's car floats, which will be loaded and unloaded, and one will disappear and another one comes in. And then up top here you got the main line with a siding in the back, and that's Amherst. Come through here. The main line siding goes through the tunnel, the branch line goes into a tunnel. Be a nice town up top here one day. Coming out here at the LRC power plant. And then behind the plant down there is the branch line coming up. Now the main line is to our left. Siding and then the branch line now coming in meeting with the siding. And the power plant was in Univille. Come through here, now you're at the hollow mine. This is a working coal loader. Those buildings will be getting moved to the other corner here, way down at that end. Here we're entering Lichtenstein. This is a module that goes to train shows. We got a grain facility and then a heater plant and then a, a little uh, interchange with uh, CP interchange. You got a double crossover and now you're entering Hershey. Hershey is another module that I bring to train shows. And Hershey is my rendition of the Hershey Chocolate Factory. It looks like we have a disabled vehicle. <laughs> And so right now the main line is close to us, sidings on the back. I have all this siding because of the modules. So this is Leon uh, Paper Mill. And this is the town of Leon. And then Leon Intermodal. This here, this open space is all going to be a big city in the future. And this little siding on the pier is Lynn Haven. And you can see the siding and the main line keep going over that way. So here's the other side. We got a crossover to get off the main, or sorry, get off the siding onto the main. 
and then there's to the right is a branch line going up to Black River which is going to be a meat packing plant and then dog food animal feed and then that's up high half inch high <laughs> here is Richards and you got a big grain facility an American Express Big John signs and then you have Williams distributing and you got Budweiser coming in with a delivery so then you come around the corner here we're entering Hickory down here is Hellertown the lowest point of my layout and then Hickory has got a major station that'll be built so far I just took a station cut it, cut it up made it to a backdrop then you got the auto facility where new cars come in and then here we got the main line to the right and then two switching leads for Willow Yard so here's the Willow Yard to the left is the engine facility then you get the lead in tracks and then there's a hardware Willow hardware on the far right against the wall. And the yard is broken up where two switchers can easily be switching at the same time. So now against the wall is the main line. Now you can take the branch line, which is like now on the far right, and then you can go into this. This will be a passenger station underneath a city. But then you take the branch line up around and that's going to be the passenger station this will be all mountain then you pop out of the mountain and you come into my logging area this is all code 70 hand lay you got a logging interchange a little interchange yard and then you got a couple industries here where there's no ties is going to be all inside a tunnel you got small saws and Suncor. Go across the viaduct. And then here, this is temporary flex track until we get a, a bridge built. And then on my right is Camp 2. Keep going across. You can run around your train if you're going to Camp 2 or run around train so you can back in. Log cars are sitting at Camp 1. Then all this zigzag here is going to be all a lake. And you got a sawmill. So then back here, you go up the hill. And now you're at Camp 2 way down there. And you go back this way. and you work your way up to a run around and then you're at camp three up, up here as you can see some rails there some's not then you take the switch and you go up the hill and the next one diverting off is camp four then you keep going up the hill and you stay to the right will be uh, Sac City and then Camp 5 this is still in working progress so it's a little messier than the others so we got Camp 5 here then you continue up the hill and off to the right is now Camp 6 go around the column you got another passing siding really a run around and keep going up the hill up the hill and up here you're gonna have this is camp seven with all the ballast and that's moose meadows and this here you can see this is from the bottom from the low point of the layout to the top I'm about almost two feet rise and the peninsula here is about 18 feet so that's the logging so then if you come back down here 
to the main line coming out of Willow Yard. To the left is the is the uh, yard lead, and then back here it's going to be all tortoises. Right now only one is. You can keep going straight through, and that's more for staging or. So that completes it, and my cousin Paul, here's my here's your update. Actually, let me go down here, because you guys might already saw that on my other post, but I have the drawing of the logging camp. Here's a drawing of the logging camp. John Sacadotti drew it up, and he's the master builder behind it, and then I've been helping him, and a bunch of other guys help him uh, doing the hand lay. Hand lay is fun, a little slow for me, but... It's neat. Alright, that's it for now. And I'll update you guys another time. See ya.